Hey guys, welcome back to Crazy Errors and hope you're doing great there. Unfortunately, we live in a world where everything is not real when we talk about the internet. So when you're using your computer, you might come across something like this what you're watching on your screen and this could be horrifying to many of us if you are very well aware of what it is then no problem however if you're a user who is not technically inclined then this is a pretty horrifying message that can really really kind of make you concerned and uh, make you do something that you're not supposed to do so this is the alert that you're getting which is showing us virus alert malware alert trojan alert and uh, looks like some kind of alert from microsoft because they are using the microsoft page with a kind of microsoft logo there's also a phone number mentioned at the bottom customer support call this helpline the very top if you notice there is another pop-up that is added with a black background your pc has been infected with trojan dot is slocker stalker maybe that's what they want to say the first thing you need to do is just calm down this is just a fake pop-up that has been pushed to your computer through some websites that you may have tried to visit too so uh, we will try to get it off it and it is not a big deal the steps to overcome this situation the first thing if you have your own technicians if you have some advisor or maybe a tech who works with you and who you believe in call them up they will simply go in and help you remove this pop-up as well as they will clean up the computer second thing if you don't have a technician and if you do it on your own then here's what we can do there are multiple tricks that you can apply in order to overcome this pop-up the first thing you can push the windows button on your keyboard the windows button looks like a button with the four tiles on it like a flag on it not flag anymore by the way just four tiles like four squares on it if you see that button on the keyboard push it once if that makes any difference nowadays these pop-ups are smarter they would not make any difference if you push that button so it is not doing anything i will also try to click on deny let's say what it does it is not going to do anything i see it is not doing anything i'll click on allow let's see what it does it doesn't do anything and the next thing what you're going to do in case nothing works there are three buttons i want you to go ahead and press all together on your keyboard control alt delete press and hold these three keys together and when you do that your computer is going to get into this mode wherein you will have few options on your screen log switch user sign out task manager we need to click on task manager from here once again the command is going to be control alt delete now you will have a window something like this it is a task manager and in this window what we need to focus on is we need to simply go ahead and eliminate first of all any browser we have got open the one we see here is google chrome and right after that it disappeared so we had the pop-up pushed through google chrome here i would also go ahead and exit microsoft edge and there it goes and there we have a normal screen however it is not guaranteed that it is just done there's still a possibility you're still going to see that pop-up alert and uh, that was pushed through google chrome so i'm gonna go ahead and click on google chrome bring it up again and we don't have the pop-up anymore however i would still go under the history and i see these are the unknown search results this one is the one probably or this one is the one that probably pushed that pop-up so i'm gonna go ahead and clear the history for 24 hours all right i've cleared the history too now the next thing you can do is you can go ahead and open your security application whatever your security program is and make sure that it is up to date and it is active at least that is something which is more important and it is protecting your device and data effectively i don't think so you should be any further worried about this moreover you should go ahead and also run once in a while a cleanup and optimizer on your computer at least once in a couple of months or maximum three months and if you don't know how to do it we made a video about it on crazyeders.com i will link that video in the description you can go ahead and check it out and once in a while at least once in a couple of months you can just follow that process on your computer whether windows 10 8 or 11 doesn't matter and you can keep your device healthier if you found the video helpful please hit the like button and subscribe for more tech tips tricks and solutions you've been watching crazy adders have a lovely day